Okay, so day 13, uh, we're on our final leg of our hike and we're hiking into Rome. And uh, the book actually says not to make the trek because it's pretty dangerous because of all the roads and we've soon figured out exactly what that meant because it was in fact all roads and some points we were actually along the side of an interstate so with dumpsters yeah Nasty yeah dumpsters. that's right yeah they don't have trash pickup there like we do so they still take everything to dumpsters and the dumpsters are like everywhere and they like sit them on the sidewalk um because they're just like literally down the city street so you don't have anywhere to walk um other than in around and dumpsters that really smell not so good and then yeah. you have traffic so you're kind of weaving in and out of traffic with dumpsters um and exhaust fumes and exhaust fumes it was not pleasant we realized quickly why the book said don't walk it but we were committed at that point and we did hit um a alternative route that takes you through the woods which was very pleasant it was like this national forest area that's really close to rome which was really nice and it was it was really buggy though there are a lot of bugs um we exited that um and uh Went straight uphill. Yep, uphill seemed like forever. Out of the woods, straight uphill. Got to the top of the hill and there was finally an official sign that pointed us one direction. But the app we were using said to go a different direction, so we went with the app because the app was there and the signs weren't, <laughs> weren't right. consistent. So we walked along the city streets of Rome with all the of the suburbs. traffic and all of the people. And so we got tired of walking and Christy pulled up her maps program and we discovered that the hotel that we were going to be staying at in Rome was actually closer than St. Peter's Square. It's actually on this side of the Vatican. So we walked a little ways on in the direction of the hotel. Took us back to the interstate. Yeah, back to the interstate. And about that time we came upon a university that had several taxis in front of it, and we decided one of them needed to give us a ride to our hotel. And yes, so that's it did. what we did. <laughs> and so we, yeah, so we went to the hotel, showered, went to get our certificate of completion, and it was closed. So it's not open on Sunday, just a note. And, um, but we went back the next day, got it, and spent a couple more days in Rome, and did kind of touristy things, went to the Vatican, and spent some time climbing the dome, and all of that stuff, highly recommend those things. And um, that was kind of the end of our trip. Yep, that was it. That was it, it was hot. It's hot in Italy. Just Very hot in Italy. And uh, so there you go.